All right, guys. I'm here at my local Walmart. 6.30 in the morning. Yeah, it's pretty early. Um, Chilly. I need to get a little bit of yarn for uh, stitch tutorials. I, I like to use like Red Heart Ombre for that. And then I'm going to get some yarn to pool. Make a, I'm going to make a... Some, I'm gonna make something uh, using the pulling technique and um, see how bad my Walmart selection sucks. Bad it is. Yeah, <laughs> it's good. It gets worse and worse every year. All right, I'm gonna gonna pick over this uh, Cadbury egg stand here, and then I'm gonna uh, I'll uh, turn the camera back on when I get to the yarn. I've only been in here 30 seconds. All right, I made it to my mom, my department. They did shorten it, but it actually is a little bit fuller than, fuller than usual. And here's my mainstay. I mentioned previously when I was at my last video, I like Walmart's mainstay. I like it better than Red Heart. Um, and we got a lot more collars at my Walmart than what we used to. Why do you like it better than Red Heart? It's, you get more yards and it's cheaper and it's softer. Oh, and it's softer. Yes. So I would choose it over Red Heart. Unfortunately, it just doesn't have the color line that Red Heart Super Saver has. But, like I said, these might be not, may not be new colors, but they're new to my Walmart. So I'm pretty excited about that because we used to only have about four colors and a couple of variegated. Okay, I come here to get, do you see any uh, pooling yarn, babe? That's your job. Um, you look for yarn. Like this kind? No, that's Omri, but I do need some of those for stitch tutorials. You do? What, let's, let's, that's stripes. Stripes. Um, let's hmm. see if they may not have it. If they don't, then we'll just uh, let's come. Let's look at prices here at my Walmart here in uh, Central Southern Central Illinois, and you guys can compare them to yours. I'm always interested. Let me know in the comments. So my big heart red heart jumbo is 7.48, and my regular red heart super saver, the regular style roll, is 3.77, and then. The uh, stripes, man, this is so pretty. Um, it's three forty-eight. It has. It's been one of my favorites. This one's beautiful too. We don't have a lot of stripes, so um, okay. Well, um, and the ombre is three forty-eight, the same as the stripes. So yeah, let's grab some ombre. Some ombres, what color? Well, I guess uh, one of each, because I use them for stitch tools quite one a bit. One of each. One of each color. Well, there's only what? There's only like five there, six there. This one. Yeah. This one. Mm -hmm. This one. Yeah. This one. Yeah. An enemy. This one. Yeah, yeah. This one. Yeah. Look at that green. Oh. It looks different than normal. Tom in the car. Purple. There's a purple and a gray too. There's a bunch. I don't need a gray. I do have a gray. Okay. Remember I told you that. Let's make sure these. I said gray. I needed to get some ombre because all I have is gray left. Oh yeah. And it doesn't. Yeah. Uh, it's not as peeling. Look, green Do looks. Like, yeah. Like that minty. green looks so different than normal. Maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just my camera. <laughs> Is it sea foam? I don't know. It's spearmint. Oh, Maybe spearmint. I'm thinking oh, of the yeah, green a apple. Minty. I don't know. I thought spearmint was darker than There's that some too. Jazzy, you want the jazzy? I do want the jazzy. That looks different too. The jazzy. Thing? That is not the same color jazzy that I have at home. What about this or one? I don't even have at home, but that I've made stitch tutorials. That you have at home. Oh, <laughs> busted. That's a Freudian slip. I don't have it. I'm just kidding. Baja blue. Yeah. Is that that one? Did you already get it? Wait, is it? Yeah. I did. You guys tell me that that does not look like Red Heart's normal jazzy. The other jazzy was really, really bright, like hot pink. I probably have scraps of it at home that I've used for stitch tutorials. I'll show you when we get home. Yeah. I'm going to compare that when I get home. Looking forward to that. I'm going to show you guys too. Just so I, I can confirm that I'm not out of my mind. <laughs> Let's see. Lime Run Hometown is 342 here. Is this stuff still made in the U.S.? Probably not. Probably not. No, made in Turkey. This is one of the last yarns. Turkey makes some good yarn. Though. Oh, they do. I like Turkey's yarn. Um, Woolies. I love Woolies. It's kind of expensive, though. Um, six ninety-seven here. So, I mean, it's a lot cheaper here than it is anywhere else. But how much is that puzzle? Six forty-two. Yeah. Premier puzzle. Make it premier. Make it with premier. Oh, and I've had people ask about this. Mainstay is anti-peeling acrylic. Ooh. It's two sixty-six here at my Walmart. Do so. They only have five colors, maybe 
They might have a round that they just don't have here. I'm not I'm not certain how many they have. But it ain't more than so they might have six colors. Five or six. But anyways, it is very, very nice. It's I would always say that I would put it up against any anti peeling yarn that is on the market. Any. From, any. Premier is well known for their anti peeling. This is just as good, if not better, than Premier. And that is in Bag O'Day's opinion only though. So it is very soft and it's less expensive. I hold your opinion to a high regard, Sensei. Thank you. 240 yards. I would buy some, but I haven't. I got too many projects on my hook right now. I wouldn't even have time to get to it. I just wanted to get the ombre for stitch tutorials. People really like those. All right. So our mandala here is 597. The regular mandala. Wait, mandala sparkle. 597. Regular mandala is also 597. Ooh, like What's that. this one? Is this one on sale? I don't know what's going on. Okay, I know what's going on now. <laughs> Glitch. Sparkle is five ninety seven. Baby is five ninety seven. Regular uh, Mandela is five thirty seven. How about your Walmart? Let me check it out. What? All three of these are the same. <laughs> it sits in the wrong spot. I, I think. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Mandela Ombre. I really wish Lion Bread would come out with some new colors of this. These have been the same colors they've had like since they came out with it. And that was before COVID. Since they came out with color? Just, no. I'm just kidding. Since they come out with this. I like the Mandela Ombre, but truthfully, I'm sick of the same colors. So I haven't used it for a while. It's $5.97 here. Our Peaches and Cream Cotton, which I like a lot for wash rags and, you know, stuff for the kitchen. $1.97. I remember when it was like 75 cents. Yeah. You're old. <laughs> I'm old. I agree. Peaches and. the school in the snow and sodas were in there. And then they got these little, uh, the striped peaches and cream that you get. How much yards are in this? Man, that's 102 yards versus the solid is. I don't use this enough to know. 120 yards. I guess there's not much of a difference. That just looks so tiny, doesn't it? It's itty bitty. It's cute though, but it's the same price. And then our cones are six or nine thirty-two. Cuteness Woo! cost, doesn't it? I said six because I remember them being at one time like five ninety-seven. I always wow. say they were like six bucks. Nine thirty-two. <laughs> Blanket yarn. Nine ninety-eight. I can't make believe you shudder that. Thinking about the price. It did. That that's wow. that's high. I mean, it's not really high if I compare it to. A big box store that has it when it's not on sale, you know, their regular price is probably 15 bucks. I'm now just, is, I'm just guessing on this that. This is too high for blanket yarn. Um, probably not. I don't use blanket yarn. I don't, I don't, I don't you not one. that's too high for it? I mean, I wouldn't pay that for it, but I don't like blanket yarn. I thought that was extreme. But if you go to other places, it's probably more, more? at, on the, regular but you can always buy and find stuff on sale so any of this yarn you really can't find it cheaper anywhere but walmart unless you are buying it with coupons at a big box store i like this pink panther yarn oh well um, that's walmart's brand stuff pink panther that reminds me of it, like his arms <laughs> oh yeah and that stuff went out man mm -hmm. man thanks sure have changed since the last time i was here and that wasn't even very long ago what is going on Oh, the mainstay is two ninety eight. Look at that blue. I wonder if that would oh, that's pool. A cool blue. Let's see how long the stripe. Can you see how long the stripes are in one of these? To pool. Can I see that? Just give me an estimate if you can tell if it's at least six inch striping effect in between them. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So ours is two ninety eight. It is, babe. It is. It is. I'm gonna try that then. It is probably six inches. Six to twelve. No. Oh. So, I mean, is it just... It's, it's consistent. It's consistent. Mm -hmm. at, least, at least six inches. Oh, is it pouring down rain? Oh, it is. I hear that rain. Oh. It's raining bad. My goodness. All right. We had, so this is uh, our mainstay, which is 397 yards for 298. And like I said, they don't have very many colors. I showed you what they had. And they only got three variegateds, but... You know what? I'm gonna grab up this. Uh, I swear, sometimes these rolls aren't full. Would you do a pink maybe, or blue? Maybe, they were maybe you should bring a scale. I should. 
put them to the test. Yeah. I like that blue, but you know what? This Let's is I'm putting this blue in the right spot. Let's go to the kitchen aisle and get a scale. We can come back and weigh these. Make sure. Now, babe, I I I explained pulling to you the other day how it made an argyle pattern, right? Yeah. Could you see an argyle in the pink and purple or the pink and red and white? Mm, pink and red and white. Of course. Of course. The I'm gonna do the pink one, and purple. Yeah, the opposite one of you. Although the blue would be really pretty. It just looks just like it fell on the floor and had better days, but I guess that doesn't matter. You got a lint roller. I got a lint roller. I do. You also have a cat. And I have a cat. He don't get nothing. <laughs> Here's the blue. Yeah. We put that blue back in the right spot. Since I'm looking. Yeah, well. since, since I work here, I will. Stop it. You're being a nice customer. Since we're seeing it and looking well, at it. Are you nice or are you? Because I would have left it. You're a jerk. I'm going to take all these. The whole box? You mean like in the box? Well, I mean, you could dump them in the car. That's their display. Well, I don't want the box. I got to find a void in a car. Well, maybe you shouldn't have bought so much McCafe coffee. And cat food. And sushi stuff. And cat food. That's what I do. <laughs> I hope I don't get any copyright strikes from this music. I say that in every video, don't I? Yeah. Get in there. Well, this is what I got then. So, these these ombres, I'm I'm gonna show you this when I get home. That that isn't. You guys, let me know if, if you've noticed a difference in the color jazzy. Oh, and the spearmint. It looks like they're just changing colors on me. This anemone looks different too. It's not as dark. I'm disappointed in that. Well, you let us know if it's on Keep your them mind the like same. it's on Crystal's mind. Keep them the same. Sea curl's pretty. Yeah. Let me grab them hooks up there. All right, I think that's it. I'll take a quick look at hooks for all you guys. Some people asked me to. There's a loom. I have an Addy. You know I'm you too- You don't need no loom. I'm too lazy for that loom. Do you know how much hero hooks are selling on eBay? I do not tell me. Enlighten I went there me. the other day, just looked. I saw one sell for like just one, like seventy-eight bucks. And then I went there the other day, and there was, was it a J? It was a J. Wow. And I went there the other day and looked, and there was someone was selling just three random ones, and, and they had bids, like a whole bunch of bids, and it was up to two hundred and like fifty bucks. Wow. Never pay that much, guys, for a hero hook. That is. Now I'm the hero. I'm turning the camera around. I am She's getting serious the now. hero hook person. That is way too much to pay for a hero hook. You can find them elsewhere. Trust me. But it's worth what you'll pay for. It is. It's worth what you pay for. It gets if you want it bad enough, you'll pay for it. People pay millions of dollars for Pokemon cards. Plus, don't pay that much because that jacks up the price to where I can't get them. <laughs> I'm just, You're setting the bar. Right I'm now. joking. I'm joking. Pay, pay whatever you think you want for a hero hook. I'm gonna turn my camera around. All right, let's see what they got in the end cap, and then we're going to go. Okay, it looks like ribbon. So, a ribbon. ribbon. And ribbon, ribbon. that's it. All right, so this oh, is what this. I got here. I got these ombres, which I think they changed the shades of a lot of them, which is odd. It's Let me know shady, in the comments. And then I got some of that mainstay in the blue. I'm going to try to color pool that and see what it looks like. And if it works out well for me, I'll let you guys know. So, I'm, hey, I'm leaving Walmart, guys, and I met a wonderful woman named Karen who works here. Do you want to say hi? Hi. <laughs> and she watches my channel. And look what she made. This is her pattern, though, and she's giving these out to her work, fellow uh, workers, right? Yeah, she said I could take one home. So, on St. Patrick's Just at St. Patrick's Day. So, I don't ever get recognized when I go places. She didn't really recognize me, but. Yeah, you too. All right, I have to show you. The difference in these these ombres all right look at this this is an old anemone color and here's a new one i just bought those are not the same at all this is so much darker than this one i know it i know it has light on the outside but even when you compare the dark to the dark in that one they're completely different and look at this is jazzy they're jazzy now that is not <laughs> I mean, oh, that's the darkest color in the jazzy and here's the old jazzy it was so much more pink and now it's like a mauve i like the old one better i like the old anemone better this is the same i checked it out Let's see i think it's the same pretty close anyways this green is completely different 
So this is the uh, spearmint, and this is spearmint as well, as you can see the difference there. The dark is not even dark anymore. This is the old one. There's not even hardly any dark in the new one. That's interesting, isn't it? I find it interesting. And this is sea coral. This is the new one that I just bought, and this was an old one that I had. And you can see that the dark is not there anymore. It's almost like they lightened them all up. You know what I mean? And completely changed the color of the jazzy. But, hey, let me know if you notice any of it. I don't have any of the other colors. Like, I don't have any of this to compare. The blue, I don't have any teal to compare. Or my Walmart didn't have any of the new teal or the teal or anything. But, yeah, let me know if you guys have noticed a difference in any of the ombres. It's almost like they muted them down. And like I said, this one's just completely different. It's not the same at all. The jazzy. And this is just kind of a muted version. The the anemone. Sea coral is just muted now. It's not dark at all. And the uh, spearmint is very muted as well. Old versus new. So. Yeah, but like I said, the blue one. I don't know. I think it looks the same. That was the lightest color before. It looks a little different, I guess. Not much, but a little. Doesn't matter. I, they're still pretty, but I do prefer the darkness of them. I'm just... I just noticed it, and I'm like... I'll see if anybody else notices it. Let me know if you guys do. Maybe it's just a bad batch of all these I got. <laughs>